So let's do an unboxing here of the newer oh, 2021 16 inch M1 Max MacBook Pro. Look at that. Behold. I'm going to try to see. That's got some weight to it. I mean, this thing. Oh my God. It's. Oh, it's it's just beautiful. Oh, Ooh, I think it's got some weight to it. I mean, whoops, it's just a package. But I'm hearing a lot of problems with these guys that versus the 14 inch that when you put it on, the, you know, when you close the lid and you charge it, or if it's off and it's you charge, you try to charge it, the darn thing doesn't charge. That comes with, you know, the hardware for the brick. I think it's got a 140 watt uh, charging uh, hub here. But I have also a 96 watt USB-C uh, charging uh, brick here from the original 2019. Let's go back in 2019 with the 16 inch MacBook Pros. So, hopefully, my hypothesis here that it's just a brick in here, something is wrong with it that you can't charge it when it's on either the laptop's closed or you know, if it's off, it doesn't charge. Uh, so, let's get to this. way all right this literally just came in today this morning it is december what the 20 i think the 20 what day is today today is december 28th all right 28th we're gonna see how this hardware here. Kick this out. Mm. MacBook Pro. Ta -da. So, for those that don't know, this is the 16 inch M1 Max with a 32 core uh, unified memory, also, as well with a one terabyte SSD card. Um, this is what the base model for the M1 Max that you can get with upgrade to a 64 gig and up to I don't know ridiculous amount of terabytes you can add into this to add a, a couple few other hundreds of dollars that can max out potentially to over six thousand dollars I think if you want the best of the best but this is just the base model for the M1 Max and I think you know even versus the base model for the 16 inch um, which you get for a, a 16 gig, you know, unified memory. Um, but the graphics on these, the GPUs, is what made me lean towards more of and getting just to make it future proof pretty much for my workflow and my usage. Um, but anywho, I mean, $34.99 plus, you know, tax on this. Um, We'll see and find out if it's worth it or not, but let's get right into just tearing up the plastic you know, packaging here. You get a nice little you know, side here just to rip it. Let's see how satisfying this is. Oh my God. How come it didn't rip perfect? Oh man. <laughs> All right, let's just do this. side now oh, that's beautiful let's get back and na -na, na -na. you know some type of like cinematic dramatic audio in the background would be very beautiful right now oh. Oh. 
it is unwrapped. Let's put that away. Okay. So, should we do a sniff test too? I don't know how you guys like my plant here. Everyone has that fake, uh, you know, wheat grass on the side of things with maybe a, a little PlayStation or Nintendo little gear here and then a mouse on one side making it look all fancy. Let's say screw that. Everyone does that crap. Let's just get to this. Ooh. Ta-da! Oh! And yes, I didn't get the space gray. I don't think I'm a fan of space grays at all. Um, to me, they just look... They, they get extra dirty. I have the rose gold uh, MacBook Air M1. And even that rose gold, they, they, you can see so much fingerprints already all over it. Um, but this right here, oh my god. Look what we just have. So, I'm not going to alter this, edit this, you know, cut this up or whatever. I want to see right now with how it is. Can it just do what it's supposed to do? Which is when I open it up, it's going to do all that pinging thing of allowing me to use it. And get into my account for setup. I want to know will this just charge as it should um, like normally any other laptops would when it's needed to be charged. I, I'm hearing a lot that it's a software issue. It could be a Monterey issue. It could be easily some type of safety uh, feature from the MacBook itself. If under a certain percentage of a battery um, amount of power onto it that it doesn't want to exceed certain amount of unneeded charging. But regardless, it should charge. Regardless of what percentage it is, the hardware back in proceeding the new 2021 M1 Max 16 inch MacBook Pro, specifically for this type, that it should charge the hardware, the computer, you know, hardware itself. Um, so let's get back to unraveling this guy. All right, let's just go up here. Ooh. Let's do a little sniff, check, check. Oh my God, that smells good. Yes, we did sniff it. Oh, shoot. Did I just tear that? Oh, man. I like to keep all my gear, even with the packaging and the wraps, mint because that's just who I am. I literally have just a collection of just the boxes of every gadget that I have and use it or store it in a condition where it can be resold. All right, back again to here. So let us now just set this up. Hello. Yes, we got it. And there it is. Oh, oh, oh yeah. That's pretty. Okay. Now it's taking me, it's gonna make me go to all these steps here. I don't wanna do that. I don't wanna do that. I don't want to do that. Do this while we're still hot. Okay. Let's get this out quick. Okay. 
This is a 140 watt charging brick for the M1 Max and or the 16 inch uh, MacBooks. I think in general the 14 inch does not come with the 140 watt um, charging brick. So okay. Oh my God, I don't know. That was just too much work. Oh my God. All right. Let's verify this. Is it 140? 100, 240. Yep, 140 watts. Can my camera pick this up? I don't think you guys are going to be able to pick that up, but. I mean, try to zoom in if you guys can, please. You guys can check. It's 140 watt. All right, that's 140. And that's the MagSafe charger, right? This is the 96 watt. Obviously, that'll charge slower than this, but what we're trying to figure out is to use English as the main language, okay. press the return key. Yeah, bro, we get it. Okay, well, I guess you guys want to see this too, right? Let's get here. Okay. So, fresh. Oh, no. I didn't want to. I, I, I just tore that. No way. Oh, that hurt. How did the. Okay. Where's the right way? Can I just. Oh, okay. If I tore that. Did you guys know I could just squeeze that out of there? This. It's like a soap. This right here, that just hurt me. Oh man, I'm so anal. Look at this. Just ripped it. Can't do anything right. All right. Let's go here. Let's plug this in. What percentage do we have? We can't figure it out. So we gotta do all this. All right, let's just go. Let's see. Blah, blah, blah. How long has it been? 16 minutes already? Come on. Blah, blah, blah. Hi. Hi, I'm Siri. Hi, I'm Siri. Choose the voice you'd like me to use. Okay. You can change it later in sys preferences. We got you. Hey, Siri. We'll set you up later. Ah, oh, this little dust ready. <sighs> oh man. Okay. Oh god, this touch ID thing. Okay. So we're on in the matrix right now. All right. Battery is at 88%. Interesting. What I want to do is shut this down. Okay. Shut that down. Shut it down. All right. Let's get back to charging it. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Well, 
that's charging. Hey, look at that. I mean, the computer's off. Did they fix it? I mean, it's December 28th. This, I'm not having any issues with this. Am I supposed to be a, having some kind of a different battery percentage? Am I 88%? I showed that I was at 88%. It's charging. It's not flashing. Interesting. Well, eighty four percent. I mean, it shows that we're good. Hmm, eighty four percent. Let's just take a look at this, guys. So, it's at 85% now, and it's charging, and, you know, I'm having no problems. I, I, I don't, I don't know what to say. So, I guess my hardware here, excuse me, has had no conflicts like I've heard from others complaining about the charging system I don't know if it's because it's brand new and I just open it up and it still has 88 per, or 85 percent battery juice does it have to be maybe below a certain amount at 50 percent or 60 percent I don't know but I just want to demonstrate that this right here a brand new MacBook Pro with the M1 Max 16 inch model that I've heard from a few other consumers complaining about the charging hub, um, you know, system not allowing it to charge when it's off. Mine charges. So, for what it's worth, hope you guys enjoy this video. Please click, you know, subscribe, comment, share if it's, you know, if I'm doing something wrong here for this test. But brand new out of the box, shutting it off, charging it. It's you know. Uh, there was no problem so <laughs> all right i'll keep uh, updating and see what happens in later you know a couple of usage with this and uh show and demonstrate later in the future if there's any type of you know problems with it all right guys